Now, before I start out, first things first. Quick shout out, Dakota Jones Productions, linked up here and in the video description. Fellow YouTuber, young vlogger just starting out with already quite a bit of content for you to watch. And I watched a couple of his videos last night and especially one that I found was very captivating that caught my attention, labeled uh, why I have all these procedures. And in that video, he very openly talks about what's up with him right now and what might be in the cards for him in the future to, to make that connection, which essentially is the community aspect of YouTube that at least I believe so. So, enabled it to grow to the extent that it has today. And it reminded me of what YouTube was like back when it started around 12 years ago. It's just people sharing their lives with others to, to make that connection, which is courageous to do and I think which deserves support. And he's also vlogging about his school life. You can see him with his friends. They goof around, they do different stuff. He's showing us his room and he's building forts and stuff like that. And it really took me back watching that back when I had a life like that, being probably more than twice his age now. So overall, it was just, just a good experience. Just uh, made me feel good to relive that again. So if you like stuff like that, definitely check out his channel. Again, linked up here and in the video description. If you like what you see, drop him a thumbs up. If you want to see more, subscribe, hit that post notification button. And overall, just support him because I think he's putting in the work to deserve it. So again, channel linked up here and in the video description, Dakota Jones Productions, go check it out. Now let's proceed with the video. Now this is my GoPro Hero 5 vlogging setup Mark 1. And if you haven't had a chance to check it out yet, you can do so via the video link up there. It already delivers great results and usability is very good. Still, today we're gonna have to make one very important addition to this setup and that is lipstick. <music> Now you might already know this setup, if you don't, super quick overview. External monitor slash remote control via the GoPro app and a smartphone. External audio hack built around the Edgeteach ETM008 mini directional love mic. External power via the GoPro audio adapter. And now with this setup, there's still some space left right here. So what better thing to put there than the aforementioned lipstick. Now we're also gonna need some 3M dual lock, low profile version. And about this much should do the trick. Cut this piece in half as well. Now apply the two resulting pieces to each other. Take the first back cover off and place it onto the lipstick like this. Take the GoPro off your ball head, remove your plate, remove the second back cover and now place the lipstick onto the Hero 5 cage right there. Just like this. Put your plate back on and make sure it's a tight fit. Put the whole contraption back onto your ball head and now you can use an adapter cable like this going from USB to USB-C to charge your GoPro on the fly. You could also use this angled version to run the cable around the whole setup with the exact same effect. Me personally though, I prefer the other option. But now here's the really cool thing about this little lipstick power bank. It stores 4000 mAh of battery power, which is the battery power equivalent of a little more than three GoPro batteries at a price point that's just a little lower than one of them. Long story short, this setup is now capable of getting you through a full day of vlogging with your GoPro Hero 5 without you running out of battery life at a much more affordable price tag than before. So if you liked the video, if you found it helpful, please make sure to leave a thumbs up. It's greatly appreciated. Any kind of comment or feedback as well and I'll try to answer as quickly as possible. Also, should you feel like supporting the channel, definitely check out the video description. There might be some product links that are interesting for you. In any case, as always, thank you so much for your time. Thank you for watching and hopefully see you again soon.